Hey everybody, this is Buddy. You ain't gonna believe where I'm at. I'm in Dallas, Texas, and I'm with Sunny Kaufman. She's the founder of the Lighthouse Library International, and here she is to tell you about it. I'm gonna post about it and put the links in the box. You'll have time to check it out. Hi. We just want to come by and say welcome to you as you drop in on Lighthouse Library International. This uh, is a website that's uh, been created over the last 14 years. It was created solely for your benefit. There's seven to eight thousand uh, teachings that are in written form on the w website and we have several hundred audio messages and teachings as well and we're just now jumping into the video idea and we're going to be adding videos to our website we just welcome you to come by anytime this library was created for you so it's your library come and enjoy it you're always welcome twenty five years ago i was given a vision by the lord and the vision is to build love centers all over the United States and perhaps even some international ones as well. But the, the purpose for the love centers is very vast. It, it involves a lot of things. It's basically to help people that at that moment cannot help themselves. And uh, there will be a, an intake office and there will be uh, ready clothing that will be obviously needed in some in instances. We're going to have a 24-hour restaurant so that if people come in hungry, we've got a place to feed them. And in that strip center uh, with the restaurant, there's going to be barber shops and beauty shops and auto repair places, audi uh, oil changes, vari various things that would fall into the line of OGAT on the job training because a lot of people are coming with needs and they don't have a way to make a living. So this is what a love center is all about. We're going to treat the people with great respect and try to do everything we can to help them get on their feet so they can help themselves. And uh, we would appreciate the prayers of any of you that uh, would be directed to join in with us to pray for these centers. And if you know someone or are one yourself that feels that they are directed to some kind of work like this, we'd appreciate hearing from you.